Hey everyone, what's up? Today I'm going to be making a 50, can you see that? A 50 gallon hamster bin cage. So I have a 20 gallon tank that I had for my past hamster and I'm deciding to get a new hamster and I thought I want to get an even bigger cage for my new hamster because my old hamster just seemed like even though like 20 is a pretty good size I always just felt like she needed more room stuff so I was like before I get a new hamster I'm gonna get a bear cage and so I was thinking of buying another aquarium but I was like it's so expensive and then I remembered bin cages I totally forgot about their existence so that's what I'm gonna be doing today okay so first thing what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be heating up this, I'm going to be lighting this candle. And I'm going to be lighting it up so I can warm up this box cutter. So I can cut this. So, yeah. My back is... This is um, chicken wire, so we need to measure out the amount of the chicken wire that we need to put on top of the lid. So yeah. Okay, now that it's all unwound, you're going to want to spread it out um, to the correct size that you're going to need. And you want to be really careful when you're doing this because it is very sharp and you can cut your hand really easily. I actually cut my hand when I got it, when I was picking it out at the store because part of it was unwrapped. So, yeah, you gotta be really careful with this stuff. It's super sharp. You gotta kind of line it up where you want it to be. <laughs> all cut out to size next thing that I'm going to do is make dots with the sharpie of where I'm going to drill holes for um, you know to zip tie it on <laughs> thing you need to do is drill a hole in all the spots that you marked so yeah Now the next thing we're going to do, we're going to get our um, chicken wire and zip tie it down. <laughs> 